Hey there, good man fam. Today's video is going to be a little bit different because I want to make sure that I show you all something that is important to your growth and understanding. There was an individual a little while ago who made a comment on one of my posts. And I have zero problem with people commenting as long as you're being respectful. You all will notice when you start getting a little bit out of hand with your comments, I'll say, be nice. That's my nice way of saying, yeah, let's not attack people in that manner. So I'm pretty reasonable. This individual made a comment. And from that comment, I thought that we were going to have a nice, rational discussion. And it just went off the rails. This is the type of male you do not want to be. Pay close attention to this. So I made this post on my channel. This is what his first comment was to that post. He said, pay no attention to women's words, just their actions. By this time, we should all have realized that women are self-serving and will use anything, anyone, any situation to assist and help themselves. They would use and even sell out their own kids. So why care what they say or think? It isn't as if we need a female's approval for anything anyway. Guys, women must live by our rules because they only survive off of us and what we provide. If men simply worked as a group, women couldn't even attempt to argue this for fear of upsetting us. Now he's correct in pretty much most of what it is that he said. So I had a response to him because that's what I try to do. I always try to respond as much as I can to the comments. Now, they've gotten a lot out of hand as far as the amount. And I'm doing as best as I can to try to get to them, but I probably won't get to all the comments ever in life now that they're coming in like they're coming in. But my response to this comment, he said, was partially correct. In your first paragraph, you're speaking about modern females, not women, good brother. That verbiage has been wrong in the RP slash Ministry of Space since the beginning. Traditional modern women do earn the right for us to pay attention to their words. They're good. However, these modern females, though, yeah, don't listen to it they have to say because they're too far gone. So you would think that his response to that would be, oh, he's agreeing with me. He's just saying there's a difference between women and modern females. So they're not the same in the female sex realm. He came back with a comment that I didn't screenshot accidentally and now I can't anymore. And it says something about how women are allowing these modern females to do these things. My response to that was, I don't know that I agree with that, good brother. Traditional and modern women can't beat what these corporations are selling, which is freaking catnip to modern females. Be free and do whatever you want. Spend whatever you want and sleep with whomever you want. And anyone who judges you, shame them. Almost impossible for traditional modern women to beat that message, especially when it's spread in Disney-like romantic-style movies and television shows, you know? That sounded pretty reasonable to me. But for some odd reason, it triggered this guy. And his response was, not if they had any biblical knowledge and a want to do right. It isn't an issue. In my view, you are part of the problem, as you leave females too many excuses. Wait, what? What do you mean I'm leaving females too many excuses? I'm not giving anyone an excuse. I'm explaining to you why it's difficult for women to fight modern females on this front. Because it is. How are all of these women going to fight the massive reach of these companies who are throwing this propaganda in like that? They can't fight them on any scale except training their own individual daughters to not be like that. That sounded pretty reasonable to me, not to mention, you can't say biblical knowledge when everyone doesn't believe what you believe. So we can't use spirituality, we have to use morality. So my response to him was, no, KW, you are. I attempted to have a rational conversation with you, but your obvious bitterness toward the female sex is keeping you from both hearing and seeing the nuance of my statements. I will make one last attempt to get you to understand. One, 
You cannot lump people who do right in with the people who do wrong simply because they're the same sex. Two, traditional women and modern women, based on my definition on my channel, both follow traditional values. One simply has a slightly higher body count and has a job outside of the home. Now, I amended this later and added in that they may also have a child. Number three, modern females, however, are chicks who prioritize attention and their job or career over their husband and children. And they don't think body count matters, so they have a high one. If you can't understand the simple nuance of this, then this channel might not be the place for you. All I was saying to him was, you need to pay attention to this nuance and you need to not sit up here and try to converse with me if you're that bitter. If that's the case, you don't want to be here because we have nuanced adult conversations here. But what do you think his response was to me? Do you think it was good? Let's see. His response was, you are the one making excuses for them and letting them off the hook. Simping will only produce the same results it has given us for years. Wait, wait a minute. Did he just say me having a nuanced conversation separating the individuals who are not doing bad things from the individuals who are is simping? See, this is what happens when you just throw words around to try to make your argument because you actually don't have one. This is the type of things that modern females do. You don't want to be an individual who does things like this. But this guy right here, he decided he was just going to take on the traits of these modern females. So once I realized the type of person that he was, after I gave him a chance, I could say the type of person that he was because I took the time to try and see how he was. What happened? My response to him was, yeah, you definitely either aren't listening and or you can't comprehend words put in the senses. Got it. Yeah, you can go. Definitely don't need a male here misusing the word simping who refuses to read and understand my words and understand his own misunderstandings. Enjoy. Peace. And I sent him to the shadow realm. This is sad because... I like to have conversations with individuals who disagree with me because I don't have a problem with that. Anyone who knows me knows that disagreeing with me is not an issue. Two things are an issue when it comes to having a conversation. One, you're an individual who thinks that you can talk to me instead of speak with me. We're going to have a problem because that means that you're not listening. So the things that I'm saying are not getting through to you. I want you to hear and understand me so that if you disagree, you at least know with what it is you're disagreeing. And the second thing, being unnecessarily, unjustifiably disrespectful conversationally. People will get mad because they don't like what it is that you said and start calling you names. Like this guy tried to do an outside of the box attack to try to say he wasn't calling me a simp. He just said the word simping. Oh, so I'm doing the act. Okay, I got to give it to him. If he says simping, that means that I'm doing the act. That's not technically calling me a simp. He used a loophole. I got it. But the fact that he was saying something about what I was doing and leading it to a negative connotation about my character, that's a problem. I don't like when people do that because that's not necessary. That's what we call an ad hominem attack. So I wanted to make sure you all understood this is the type of male you do not want to be for a few reasons. One of them being, if you're that type of male here, I'm going to not tolerate it, of course. This is going to be a series that I'm doing, and I need you all to understand. If you don't know how to converse without being unjustifiably disrespectful, then I'm going to do something really simple. And that's called send you to the shadow realm. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe and comment. Now, if you want to share it, go ahead and do that too.